Edward R. Davis is my great-great-grandfather. He is the founder of our company. He was originally a tinsmith back in 1870. When I was very young and my grandfather was running the company, we were largely focused on the paper mill industry. In the early 70s, my father felt that we needed to diversify beyond the paper mill industry. So he made the decision to pursue DuPont. And with that, he realized that we needed to have a safety program. We implemented our safety program over 40 years ago, and we've had to adapt and change based on history. If we don't change with time, I don't think we would be here today. I think that's really critical, being open to change and looking at what the next innovation is so that we can stay ahead of the curve. A lot of modular projects are done in a fragmented a methodology where somebody builds the frames, somebody's building the tanks and pipings. At M. Davis, frames are built here, piping and vessels are built here. It's assembled here, it's integrated, it's powered, it's tested, it's shipped and literally loaded out of the building we're sitting in. In a modular process, it starts on the design side. That's somebody working at a computer, working in two-dimensional or three-dimensional drawings. From there, it comes out onto the floor. The structural component is usually first. Steel fitters, welders, riggers, moving the components around. After that, we're fabricating pipe, fabricating vessels, putting those components together. While that work's going, the design for the automation and electrical is happening. Panels get built, designs finalized. All the components get assembled, We've got millwrights, electricians, fitters, welders, putting the entire package together and then ultimately it's loaded by riggers onto a truck and sent out the door. What makes it a journey is every project, it's like pulling on a string. The more you pull on it, the more you find, and the deeper it goes. One of the things that helps with that is partnering with someone like M. Davis who helps us with that respect. We started with Air Liquide, I don't know how many years ago, and built into the partnership, the relationship that we have now, and growing a workforce and a business that could satisfy what Air Liquide was looking for. M. Davis was chosen because of their ability to truly partner with us and help us develop the technology. In some of our early designs, we quite honestly weren't sure what we wanted, what we needed to do, and the guys at M. Davis were able to come up with solutions that we didn't even see in front of us and make it more efficient in the end. When I was growing up and my dad was running the company, he always told me that without the people at M. Davis, we don't have a company. I really believe that that is still important today, just as it was when he took over the business, because we are a family. It's the people. The people at M. Davis, they don't treat you like a customer. 